check two one two. What's up? It's DJ Divine Justice over here talking about my uh, tractor four deck control for a machine. Um, I have this one page called Record where I set up the ability to um, record um, and monitor the record volume. So over here I got the record volume map there. It's not quite working. Um, and then I've got these buttons for, for loading. So what I notice is that if I, if I have a loop playing on V and I record it and I get the timing right and then load it to deck A, it'll play it as a loop. If you've seen the new controller, the S4, um, that's what they're, they're doing. So I'll give you an example of what I'm talking about. I'll let this beat play and then I'll press the record on beat and then load it to deck A and then you'll see that loop playing over here. Let's go to the other track. Go over to deck A. Yeah, that loops a little bit off, but you get the point. That's how to uh, immediately record and play back your loops. Um, the functions for uh, loading those tracks are in the controller editor. Um, so that as soon as you record something, you can immediately um, map it to a deck. That would be in um, recording. After you go to um, add in, you're down to recording. And that last one is load last recording. And so I just did that one four times and assigned uh, it to each deck. So that's how I have the load for all four on, right there on the, at the top. So hope that helps you uh, record and make some fresh loops. DJ Divine Justice signing off. Practice and enjoy.